this is actually very good guys i can taste my spices and all my flavors it is so creamy and so nice welcome back welcome back welcome back welcome on everybody so i'm sure you've all seen that viral tiktok video right that big feta pasta if you've not yet seen it and i'm pretty sure you will see it soon so today i am making a tiktok recipe mm -hmm. so I'm gonna be adding my own ingredients just the same, just to make it taste better. So, come on, come on, let's go, come on. So the ingredients, very simple guys, like very, very simple. Like, simple one, two, one, two, three, tricks and trade in a matches box, right? So, I'm using some basil, not using fresh basil. That's optional. Tomatoes, of course, using grape tomatoes, olive oil, salt, black pepper, parsley. I got some pepper flakes over here. Because, and I know some have to put pepper in a hit. Yeah, I gotta put peppers in it, right? We got some feta, some feta cheese, feta cheese. Mm. And of course, we got some minced garlic. And because pasta goes nice with wine, I'm going to add some Pinot Grigio to this. Right? I mean, it's only rust. And I'm using a spaghetti. Yeah, you use the pasta of your choice. And my favorite is spaghetti. All right, guys. So my oven is preheated. I've washed my tomatoes, washed my hands. First thing, cleanliness is next to godliness. I'm pretty much taking some salt, sprinkle on the tomatoes, take my pepper, sprinkle in here. Now I'm going to take the entire block of feta cheese. This is an 8 ounce block. Pretty much just sitting it right in the middle there we go I'm gonna add some salt and pepper pepper this is where my olive oil comes in place there we go Next, I'm going to add some pepper flakes. This is optional, guys. I like pepper, I like spices. Put the whole thing in, right? This is also where I'm going to add my garlic. Add as much garlic as you want. It's your taste buds. Um, do whatever you desire, right? I like garlic. There we go. No, I'm pretty much just going to put this in the oven for 30 minutes. And we still have some other stuff to do. Alright, so the oven is preheated. I'm going to put this in for about 30 minutes. Okay, guys. So I'm adding some salt. Added some salt to my water. I'm going to have it come to a boil. And then I'm going to add my pasta. I'm going to add my spaghetti. No, spaghetti normally takes about, say, anywhere between 8 and 10 minutes to cook. So, by that, my feta cheese, tomatoes, and everything will be out of the water. 
I just added some salt to my pot and that's pretty much it. Okay, so y'all see that? Choop, choop, choop. So my water pretty much came to a boil. And I'm gonna add my spaghetti. So I'm going to leave this for about 9 to 10 minutes and I'll come back. Oh guys look at this. So I've removed my tomatoes and better from the oven. I am so proud of myself. Look at this. It smells so yummy. And oh look at this. This looks absolutely amazing. My pasta just waiting for it to be finished. We have about two minutes left for my pasta. Just look at this, guys. So creamy, so nice. Okay, so I am going to add that's my timer for my pasta but I am going to add one third cup of Pinot Grigio to this I'm gonna put it back in the oven for five minutes and then I'll add my pasta now this is optional um, this is pretty much my version so if you want to then yes you could but that's pretty much up to you just look at that I'm gonna add this back to the oven for about five minutes. Look how creamy and juicy this is. Oh my God. I'm so proud of myself. All right guys, so I'm pretty much just taking my pasta from the pot and pretty much just adding it to this. Let's get this all mixed in. This looks so yummy. I can't wait to taste it, guys. Right, guys we are almost finished I'm just going to add some parsley to this then I'm going to add some basil oh my god I can't wait to taste this Look at this. All right, so let's see if this lives up to the hype. Let's see. This is actually very good guys i can taste my spices and all my flavors it is so creamy and so nice mm. you should definitely try this you should try this 
But until next time, bye.